what's going on y'all i'm here uh johnny fuller uh it's in Buford highway in uh i guess it's doraville but uh reason i'm here is because for a while ever since i installed the headers i don't think the flanges were tightened up um and we tried to do it with me and my nephew and i don't think it was enough people or enough we was on the ground doing the install and I took it to a shop to get it looked at and I don't think he did a good job. So here I am today, a year later, and gonna have it looked at. Um, and I really think that it took about three people to get it done uh, because with two people on the ground, it just didn't work. And the last guy I took it to, I paid like 80 bucks and it's still there, the problem's still there. So gonna have a look at it and y'all stay tuned Bow, some little bitch So we found a leak and it's right here. Um, they're gonna try to tighten it up. It sucks because I paid already once to get it looked at. Taking good care of me. Yeah, baby need a wash. Can't believe that's all it was. That one's hard to clean. I gotta get some soap and some water. And we in there, baby. All right, y'all, so this is my nephew, Carlos. He dates my uh, niece. Uh, this is Carlos. This is his shop. So he's here on Buford Highway. Y'all make sure y'all check him out. Anything you want to tell him? Uh, yeah, I mean, we work on any cars. You got an exhaust problem? Bring it by. Wait, we, we got you, bro. Yep. So all exhaust, all maintenance, custom exhaust. You know, let him build it for you and show you what he can do. I seen his work. Looks dope. Make sure y'all come check him out. It's on Buford Highway in Doraville, right? So bye bye. Yes, sir. We back up in here. Uh, look what we got here. Got uh, um, you know, my Gen Y hitch, your bitch. Uh, shout out to the girlfriend. Yeah. Raffle winner. Raffle winner for the group. In our group, the Kid Bat Legends, uh, we usually have some some meetings, and then we try to do a raffle at every meeting. We didn't do one the last one, but we did one uh, in appreciation to those who showed up. Uh, to the shows this year uh some people have been missing and but my girl wanted to show some appreciation to those who showed up lee happens to be the winner uh we did two drawings dallas won the other one but we got to figure out what size lift he's getting before we get his but he got his ready for lee to open his up whenever oh he don't him yeah hey, i heard he don't he don't fuck with y'all he trying to get these spacers basically they're going to powder coat um lee has some spike lug nuts that we dropped off last week the thing about them is they got to be able to hang so they can coat it and put it in the oven so the best solution is to put them on these spacers and they can paint that what the fuck? damn you janky as hell I'm gonna make shit nice you see you did might want to get that painted. I want to say. Okay, muscle man. I'm working out. You see me? Oh yeah. God damn, this bitch heavy as fuck. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah. Nah, this heavy as hell. <laughs> you need to get a boat lock. Some locks right there, what that is? Yeah, but the boat lock, you know, you can use your key. You don't want nobody stealing that shit. Oh. Or at least make it harder. Oh, yeah, that bitch don't be stupid. Oh, and then put the lock on it? Yeah. Don't get that on there, too. Struggling what? trying to get this shit off. Why are you struggling out right here? Again, Daniel. You only got one though, huh? What? Lock. Lock? Mm. That'd be sexy. <laughs> Thanks, Kim. You know, work hard for the round. <laughs> Should disqualify your ass. <laughs> uh, if I go out of town tomorrow, it'll be a waste. Yep, be dirty again. Hey, you know what you do with this? <laughs> <laughs> Everything gonna blow like it. <laughs> All right, guys. So it's Saturday morning. I'm um, here picking up my baby. We just decorated the truck for her graduation parade. Yes, sir. That was bad. That was bad ass, bro. Yeah. Well, I wish I could drive like this every day. <laughs> I win every car show. Hey, hey that black and chrome. I mean, that black, black and gold look good, though. That's what Ariana wanted. I that look dope. That's Aaron, that's my nephew. Oh, yeah. 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 I'm getting on the roof. Yeah. All right, so we out here. It's us being us. We ended up being late and it was real short. Nothing going on. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, I wish I filmed this last night, man. But I guess this video's topic is about the Gen Y hitch. It finally, finally paid off for me last night. And it's a wonderful feeling. So yesterday I didn't feel much at all because I was just chilling with my baby, uh, with the family, and it was just more of our time, not anybody else's. Uh, we ended up going to a car show. Uh, we got best modern truck. Um, it's all right though, but we were one. Shout out to Dreams Motorsport. We were kicking it with them uh, yesterday. But when we got home, we had went to McDonald's to the drive-through. And I'm gonna tell you something. This Gen Y hitch is the truth. Now the reason why I bought this hook, well, the whole reason I bought the hitch was to protect myself more from the back. Now I wasn't hauling anything, but I needed something back here to keep from whatever. Texting and driving is a common thing. And last night, this hook saved me. Not a single scratch. Not a single scratch at all on the hitch. Uh, it was a Dodge Charge. Uh, it was a Dodge Challenger. I guess it, he wasn't paying attention. Foot let off the brakes. He was too close. He was too close. We're sitting in the drive-thru and all you hear is a boom. I'm like, what the hell? So we come back, check. He looked at my truck. He looked at his car. And he was like, damn. I was like, man, it's all good. That's why I keep that there. Uh, so if you're looking for rear end protection, it's not just for towing. It's not just for pulling. I keep it on there for safety or to protect my vehicle as best as I can. Uh, something for y'all to think about. Uh, that's why I like Gen Y Hitch or any other uh, company would do. But I like Gen Y because of that monster hook. So if y'all consider it, make sure y'all check them out. But today, I'm actually on the way to pick up my homeboy from Florida. Uh, he's down here for work. Uh, we're finna go check out Laos Temple. I'm Cambodian, so 
anybody that knows anything about Southeast Asia, it's New Year's. Uh, I guess it's uh, last New Year's, it's like two months long, so y'all stay tuned. Bow, some more bitch. So is it? All right, so this is what we're doing in our community is uh, we're building a truck. Yeah, probably. Um, so I got this new 2020 uh, Silverado. It's sitting on a seven or eight inch ready lift. He's got 24 by 14 RBPs on the Furies. 1450. Oh, 1550. It's clean. But yeah, shout out to my boy. So he kind of rushed into doing this, and I tell everybody just do it. You do it once and do it right the first time. Be patient. Uh, there's a national back order on everything. Um, so he went with 24s because he was a little scared of. 26 is being too big, but he's definitely going that route. He's actually thinking about going to a 10 inch uh, lift, probably Magoy. As you can see, he's got the ready lift. But it's not too bad. He said that the ready lift. It's an 8 inch ready lift, but it shakes when he hit bumps in the rear and he don't like that. So on the next lift that he gets, he's probably, we're going to help him get a smoother one. But y'all stay tuned on this one. Shout out to Street Queens. This is family the Street Queens out in Albany, Georgia. Truck club out there. Shout out to my boy Tom. This is brother's truck. Yes, sir. Y'all see this? This is motherfucking huge. It's got a, the Morimoto's. KC headlights. I mean, the, the KC lights. I don't know what he got. He's got a ready lift. That motherfucker huge. We look short as hell. Oh, man. But yeah, we are here at the Laos New Year Festival. Y'all stay tuned, I'm finna go kick it. Wow. I'm on the bitch.